welcome back to Super Mario RPG Randomizer. I am Travis, also known as Tanuki. What the hell? Uh, okay. <clears throat> so, whoa. So anyway, that just happened. Master Blaster. But, <laughs> sorry, that just really caught me off guard. Um, I wasn't expecting to see a hammer just, like, bouncing around on the ground. Which means the boss of this location is most likely Hammer Brothers. I would assume. Which means they're not too far off from where they were at before. Uh, last episode, if you missed it, we got we started as Bowser and we we uh we looked at some of the shops bought a couple things for Bowser because I figured out that the very first boss of the game was actually Axum Rangers and honestly I was scared of them they didn't put up that big of a fight really it was just the green one the green one hit me with Sledge, which nearly killed me. And I healed myself with 4 HP remaining. So, but anyway, uh, Axum Rangers gave me Mario, as well as a Star Piece. So, that's pretty good. I believe they also gave me Safety Ring. And this is all the stuff that I've managed to find in chests so far. Not counting chomp shell or work pants. Those two I bought because I was afraid of the Axum Rangers. So I went and found some stuff for Bowser and purchased them with my monies. Um, once again, spinies aren't ter- spikies, I guess they are here. Aren't terribly worth it. Um, I still only get one experience for two of them. Hmm, something doesn't seem right there. <laughs> okay. I, uh, I appreciate you, Hammer. I definitely appreciate you. Uh, I kind of want to fight those things just to see... What sort of a battle it is, but I don't feel like jumping down there, so we're just gonna grab this thing that was originally a Caro Caro Cola. Well, we're gonna try. Now it's a frog coin. <laughs> uh, that's just that's just that is the perfect amount of ridiculousness to me. Okay. Okay, for some reason I thought I was in... Here we go. This is where I thought I was at. <laughs> I was like, where is it? Oh. That's anticlimactic. That's even worse. One experience point, no coins. Alright. No whammies, no whammies. Pants. Pants are overrated. I will take that statement to the grave. You don't see Spikey's wearing pants. Hell, not even Bowser's wearing pants. And in some sense of the word, Mario's not wearing pants. I mean, if you consider pants in the very traditional sense. Uh, overalls are technically pants, but they're kind of more than pants. So they're extremely overrated. Oh. Okay, so stars are not randomized. Come here! Ah. 
So... I'm not surprised Bowser didn't level up, but I'm very surprised Mario didn't level up. Nah. Bad dog. Ow. How much you want to bet I only get one experience point for this battle? If I'm lucky, I'll get two. Certainly not gonna get three. Lucky! Well, like, I guess the canines are good for something. Poison. Thank you. Oh my god, I got a three experience points. But do I double that? Win big or lose it all? I'm gonna lose it all. I used to be good at this. Well. <sighs> Woe is me. Those three experience points would have made a huge difference. Get away from me, canine. Yeah. Bracer. Brace yourselves. We got a hammer on the loose. <laughs> Super slap. So it's... Oh. We got a shyster and some booze. Um. I... I do like the fact that... Uh, when I when I find an, find equipment, I know exactly who it goes to because it's the same as the original game. Uh, on one hand, I, I mean, on the other hand, uh, I did kind of like. Um, that sucks. Seeing um, other characters using different items, although technically it's very glitchy. Because, let's say, for instance, well, okay, <laughs> so booze suck in this, they just nuked me. Damn it. Uh, as I was trying to say before, I was so rudely annihilated. Um, if you randomize the equipment, that means Bowser could theoretically have a hammer. However, when you use a hammer, he then changes into Mario, but with Bowser's color palette? Looks really weird. And that could be one of the reasons why when I played this before, it was uh, kind of laggy in battles. I don't know what I'm gonna do about those boos except just try to avoid them because that was ridiculous. I mean if they if they had hit Bowser with the move that they hit uh, Mario with, I would have survived. But they hit Bowser for like 78, which is more than both of them combined, actually. Barely, but it is. So yeah, I, I certainly wasn't expecting that. I didn't go up here. I need my pants. I know they're overrated. But. The more I think about it. Yes, pants are overrated. But ignore my whole overall philosophy. 
Overalls are definitely pants. I'm just an idiot. I don't think there's anything technical about it. They are pants. I was just trying to sound really deep and profound and like kind of get you guys to think. Oh, I leveled up this time. Mario reaches level three. His max HP goes up by three. He learns jump. Okay, well that's, that's actually gonna be useful. And he actually, whoa. Definitely going there. I mean, without a doubt, he needs more magic uh, defense. Well, they both do. But... Not everything's using magic against me, but everything is attacking me. So at this point, when he's got so little HP, he really needs... Um, that extra uh, buffer of HP. Okay, so super slap and just avoid. Wow, this is gonna be hard. I don't know which way he's facing. Okay, I think I know which way he's facing, but these Koopa troops are pain in the ass. All right. No text boxes either. So that's two, one more. Not you. All right, there we go. And they are Hammer Brothers, which makes sense. <laughs> of course. He's immune to jump. I mean, I guess he does have a helmet on, so. Stop! Hammer time! Ow. Not ow. Why didn't that hurt? Oh, probably because of my armor. Never mind. Duh. Alright. Damn it! Bowser, you need to work on your accuracy. Munch, munch, munch. Hey, stop it. I feel like the other one died faster. A lot faster. Haha. -ha. I blocked it. I know there's such thing as a perfect block, and I've done a couple of them actually. Uh, during this playthrough, I don't know if I've done it this episode. But uh, yeah, I'm, I'm not, I'm not really that good. One, one, two. Wow, this, this one sucks. I could go for the two defense. But I feel like the two magic defense would be even more beneficial. Not to mention I get two, uh, two magic power out of it. Castle key number two. Warfan. I mean, I don't know if I really want a fan that's... A fan about war. <laughs> if I if I'd actually managed to spit those words out correctly, that might have been funny. But probably not. Um Yeah, I was right. I couldn't remember if I needed to come here or not. Watch this. I have a vibrator! Maturity is my middle name. It's just too bad that my first name is M.
I, I certainly hope somebody watches this video and calls me out for that extremely awful joke. Double my coins? Yeah, sure. I don't care if I lose my coins. Okay, I kind of care. Thanks, Mario. I'll continue to stand watch. But now everyone seems suspicious. By the way, look what I found. Ten, ten coins. Congratulations. So I think in my original randomized playthrough, which was several months ago at this point, um, Bowser actually knew Thunderbolt. Honey syrup, I think that was. My wallet's gone. But yeah, Bowser knew Thunderbolt, so he was always in my team. Because Thunderbolt is, without a doubt, the most useful ability in the entire game. Because it's a cheap way of dispatching smaller enemies. Um, I don't remember if he actually had a very good magic attack stat or not. Don't really need to talk to Raz and Rainy right now. <laughs> Super Hammer! I feel like their apartment, or their, their house, got a lot bigger suddenly. And now it's smaller. And now it's bigger. It's weird how that works. Well, at least these guys give out luckies. Although I don't know why it doesn't seem to really be that randomized for these guys. Double your experience points. Let's see if I can lose a third time in a row. <gasps> I got it right! Yeah, that's the spot. See, I was a jerk to this kid before, so should I... Should I take out his friend or not? Yeah. I mean... If I was a jerk to him before, I should be a jerk to him now. Okay. Amulet. Ooh. If you've played this game and you don't jump on the bed or you don't jump on this kid's head, then can you really say you ever played this game? Alright, let's see if the amulet is any good. Whoa. Okay, so plus seven, plus nine, plus eight, plus three, immunity to ice, uh, half damage, fire, and electricity, minus one speed. So overall, that's much better than the antidote pen. Uh, I don't get the KO or the scarecrow immunity. But otherwise, it's much better. I'd be a fool not to. I was imitating him. And later, they're going to be like, This guy doesn't even bounce. We should bounce on his head. So, 
I'm doing a preemptive bouncing on their head. So that when they do it to me, it's warranted. <gasps> Look what you stand in it. Ha, gotcha. How nice. What a sweetie pie. Was the princess kidnapped by those things outside? Are they part of this? Oh, shut up. Oh, shut up. Oh, shut up. Oh, now look. I lost because of you. Yeah, well, you deserve it. See, I'm wide awake. Now I guess it's time for me to win big cash. He's talking about a casino that doesn't actually technically exist right now. But kind of does because we're in this world's open world state. We're, we're in this weird open world state. That's the words. Unfortunately, this, this particular episode isn't terribly randomized and it's a little disappointing aside from, you know, chasing a hammer around in the forest. Yeah, we're going to be doing a ton of these. <gasps> I'm on a winning streak. What do we got? One. Well, that sucks. Seven. That's pretty damn good. And one. We'll go with seven. C -c -c Come here. Come to daddy. Lucky. You know I'd be even luckier if you just die. Double your coins. Where's Yoshi? He <laughs> yeah. ha. Oh yeah, let me talk to you. The vault guard. Oh, that vault guard? I come here to save him, and he runs into the next room. Well, so much for him. Yeah. And, okay, another one. Is it the exact same, though? It is. Okay, I figured it would be, but I wasn't 100% sure how the randomizer did things. But these are back. Well, I guess one flower isn't too bad. And there they go, all bouncing on my head. It's kind of like that song, Raindrops Keep Falling on My Head, except it's Shy Guys. And taken out of context of a Mario universe, that's super creepy. Toadstool's room. What are those things out there anyway? Aw, but I want to sleep in her bed. Definitely should save it, because as I've learned from the booze, anything could theoretically kill me instantly. If they just have the right magic attacks. Nom 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 nom. figured I should take these things out because I pretty sure I still I'm still supposed to like escort toad to the room but it's a little difficult to tell considering all the toads look the same that'll do pig yosh 
shirt. Yo shirt. Kind of like yogurt. Or maybe it's like you got yogurt on your shirt. On yo shirt. I don't know. I'm just rambling at this point. Honey syrup. That time I wasn't even actually paying attention, so. Okay, we got two, 11, and three. I mean, how can I turn down 11? Yep, doesn't even have to scoot by this time. Froggy stick. Don't I don't I already have a froggy stick? I have a ribbit stick. And two froggy sticks, yes. Okay. So it's good to see that the uh, the pool of items contains plenty of repeats. And I'm still not like I still haven't actually earned anything specifically for Bowser. So, in my original playthrough, the characters actually had random names as well. Like, I think Gino was actually Magikoopa, or at least that's what he was named. And I thought that was kind of cool. Apparently I missed that this time. Not so fast, pal. Look at him. Can't even bounce. Hey, maybe we can bounce on his head. Oh. You know, I really like these these guys. And I think it's mostly because they're great. And knife. Okay, let's see if I can jump on them. That's a big negative. See if I can jump on the other one. That's a big negative. Well, I'm so glad that I learned jump and it's worthless. So I am a little bit overpowered because of the item that I bought. <laughs> and that's partly why I didn't want to go, you know, looking for something even better. Eventually, it'll level out, though, especially if I don't get any new items at any point. At least this guy's taking a couple more hits. But since they're not actually using any special attacks against me, they go down very quickly and easily. Rock candy! I will certainly take that. Oh, it doesn't look like they have a star, though. Okay. So, that's the end of that one. I'd call that a success. So, where to next? Oh, wait. Gotta talk to you. Well, he's got that, which is awful. That, which is okay. That, which is very bad. And that, which is also very bad. OK. 
Okay, so that's the end of that. Um, I guess next episode we will go to Karo Sewers and Midas River, probably Tadpole Pond, maybe even some Roseway. Depending on how long it takes me to get through the sewers. So once again, I hope you guys are enjoying the Super Mario RPG randomizer. Uh, be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoy it. And uh, let me know what you think. And once again, if you have played any randomizers or would like to see me play any randomizers, then uh, go ahead and mention them in the comments. Uh, I guess I will see you guys next time. Bye.